Hey folks, this is Eric Gould and some good news. Uh, Lightroom has been updated today. It is now, look at this, it is now 2015.8. And the big change to it is adding the ability to have a reference module. Uh, the idea is here, I'm looking at this flower here and if I've edited one previously, like this one here, and I wanna put them side by side and compare them and have one static on one side and one on the other side that I can edit, Lightroom has added a new bit to the toolbar. If you see down here, uh, if I press here, what it's gonna allow me to do is to drag in one of the photos. So I wanna take, this is my reference photo. I'm gonna drag this over here, and now I can come over here, and I can edit this the way I want, and look at this at the same time while I make those changes, you know, going back and forth. Now, the key thing here is, if I move out of this for some reason, let's go to the library, and then I come back in, it disappears. So let's drag that back in again. Okay, that's my reference here. And if, if I wanna keep it there, then I have to click on this little lock here, and that will stay going back and forth. Now, some people may say, well, I don't really see this toolbar over here. If you hit the T, that turns that on and off. And if you wanna get out of this completely, you can click this icon over here, or you can hit D, and then you're back to where you were in the normal view. And of course, you can come back in here. And because we hit locked, it's backwards and forwards. So is it a big feature, is it a huge feature? It's, just, it's an incremental feature. It's a nice feature to have when you're comparing to. There were ways to do this before. This is an easier and cleaner way to make it happen.